When you're building e-learning courses, it's a good idea to have closed captions for your audio narration. Not every project requires it, but if your course has to be accessible, it definitely needs to have closed captions. Unfortunately, Articulate Storyline doesn't auto-generate closed captions yet. You have to manually type it in or paste it in the script. I do think it's only a matter of time before they have this feature. For now, thankfully Adobe Premiere does the closed captioning. You can create the closed captions in Adobe Premiere and export the caption file from Premiere and import it to Articulate Storyline. Let's jump right in and go over how to auto-generate the closed captions. Again, you need Adobe Premiere for this. Open Adobe Premiere, then create a new project. When you get to this pop-up, you can rename it if you like. Find out where your file is going to be saved. Then click OK. From here, you want to drop your MP3 file or WAV file into the Import Media section. Now we want to look for the window that has the closed caption and the transcribe feature. Mine is not showing up. To find that, you go to Window and then go down to Text. Here the text window pops up where you can see the transcript in the caption section. Now that we have the window open, let's drop the audio file to the timeline. You can see the audio file, and now in the captions window, you have the open to transcribe option. We want to transcribe the audio file first, so click transcribe sequence. A new dialog box opens. Since the only thing we have is this one audio file, we can just click the transcribe button. It'll take some time to analyze and transcribe. Great, now we have the transcript. We're almost there. From here, click the Create Captions button. A new dialog box opens. Just leave everything as default, and then click Create. Now you can see the closed captions. You can even see it on the timeline. The bulk of the work is done. However, since this is an auto-generated file, there is going to be errors in the captions. But we're not gonna edit it in Premiere, we'll edit it in Storyline as it is easier to do. And ultimately that's where it's going anyway. What you want to do now is click on the more button and click the export to SRT file. We want to go back to Storyline to the slide that has your audio narration. Go to the timeline and click the audio file. Then go to options, then click the import captions button. Find the file that you exported. Then click on edit captions. You can see now that your captions are created. This is very important. You are not done. You will for sure have errors from this auto-generated captions file. So what you want to do is go through the captions and make any changes. This course focused on options and considerations in response to an active shooter, including the importance of rehearsals, both mental and physical, to work through the arc of survival and take timely and effective action. The flexibility you have with a plan that includes running, hiding, the flexibility you have with a plan that includes running, hiding, there, there should be a period, and fighting, period and consideration right there. for each method. The importance of knowing. All right, here, that should have been a period. Should separate sentence. All right, cut that. Move it over here. The importance here. of knowing life-saving skills to yeah. stop bleeding and Paste where to find a first aid kit. Here I'm going through the captions and making corrections to any errors I see. Once you're done, you click save. Then preview the slide and double check the captions to make sure everything looks good. Based on options and considerations in response to an active shooter, including the importance of rehearsals, both mental and physical, to work through the arc of survival and take timely and effective action. The flexibility you have with a plan that all right, we just auto created closed captions in Adobe Premiere, imported it to Storyline, and made corrections to make sure the closed captions look good. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. Thanks for watching.